Hello everyone, if you are new here, then welcome, I am Tatevik. If you have already seen me, then what's up guys? I hope you are doing great, I hope you are motivated during these lockdown days and today's video idea is to give you a study plan for learning the basics of programming. Well, if you are new to programming, I know it seems hard, but believe me, it's not. If you know like which points you shall learn after which points or before which points. So here I am telling you a study plan. I also did a small poll on Twitter and you guys helped me a lot by participating in it. So you are motivating me, thank you very much. And to start with, you just choose one of the languages that you are mostly interested in, say you choose Python or Java, and you start learning with these points. So I have separated four topics for the basics of programming and each topic has its own specific points. So those four topics are introduction to computer science, introduction to object-oriented programming, data structures and algorithms. So let's see the points of introduction to computer science first. When you have successfully completed and you know the ideas of those points, you just go to Introduction to Object-Oriented Programming. And then we come to Data Structures. The final thing is the algorithms. Now you might all say that the hardest part is getting the knowledge of the algorithms. Well, I know that, but let me tell you a story that happened to me in my life. I was being interviewed for iOS and they have asked me to write DFS and BFS on a paper. So the algorithm is a must for being a good programmer and it doesn't matter whether you are planning to become a backend engineer or a frontend one, they may ask you and it's also like a really good base for uh, writing a really good code. You might have seen that there are points which are optional, but believe me, if you have gone through the previous points, then you are not going to have any problems with those optional ones and these are really good for being a really good computer scientist. A bonus thing, I'll be speaking about any of these points if you request one on my social media. So follow me on social media, I am Tatevik Tome on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, GitHub, in every platform. Let me know your thoughts, please subscribe, like and share my videos, watch my previous video in which I'm talking about top learning applications and how I became a software engineer using some of those and I'll see you next week!